In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to authenticate your domain using Facebook Business Manager. Hi, I'm Brandon. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that all important notification bell if you want to receive a notification every time I upload a new video to my channel. So let's get started with the training today. For that, we're going to head into our personal Facebook profile and we're going to go access our Business Manager account from there. If you have not yet created your business manager account, I will link to a video above where you can go and watch how to create your business manager account. But for now, head over to the menu on the left hand side of your page, select see more and you'll have a business manager menu option there. Go and select that. And while we're waiting for the business manager account to load, you'll see now that it's been rebranded as Meta. You'll go and select your business manager account. If you have multiple business manager accounts set up, select the business manager account that you wish to verify the domain for. Head over to the hamburger menu in the top right hand corner on the left hand menu. Select business settings. Once in business settings, scroll down all the way through to brand safety, go and select domains. And in here we can verify the domain. As I already have one domain verified against this particular business manager account, I'm going to add a second, head over to the add button, select that. And what you want to enter in here is just your root domain. So that is just the name.com or .co.za or whatever it is that you might be putting in there. So the domain I'm verifying today is affiliate success lab.com and I'm going to go select add. As you can see over here, affiliatesuccesslab.com has been added to my list of domains, but it is at this stage not verified. And you can see in big red letters is also not verified. So the next step here is to actually go and verify it. The default option here is to add a meta tag HTML source code. And really what you're going to do here is you're going to copy this piece of code that Facebook have provided to us. And we're going to go paste that into the header section of our home page of our blog or our particular website. There are two other options that you can go and use in order to verify your domain. You can upload an HTML file to your root directory, or you can update it on your DNS zones and in order for your domain to be registered. So we'll head with the easiest option that Facebook are providing us with, and that is adding the meta tag to our source code. So for that, head over to your website editor in order to edit, to edit that section of your homepage. This particular website is hosted with system.io, so I'll head over there once you're logged in, head over to blogs in this particular case, I head over to my blog site and here is my home page. I head over and I select edit and I head over to settings in the top left hand corner and I scroll down to the edit header section. I select that. I head back over to my business manager account and I come and copy this particular code. You'll see once you just click on the bolded text, it'll copy it straight to the clipboard, head back and either right and click and paste or control V. And you'll see that that piece of text is now inserted into the header section of my page. I then select save, select save my changes and I can head back out of that particular page now. So once I've headed back to my business settings page, I can now select the URL for my website and we'll go and open that up in a new tab that will then open up my particular page. I can right and click on any white space on my particular page, head down to view page source that will load the source code for this particular page. And what you can do here is do a control F, which will actually find and in here, we can just search for Facebook. I've already done that once, put that in there. And here you can see that there's the, the Facebook domain verification content and there's a code over there. If I head back to my business settings page, you can see there's the Facebook domain verification content and it's a QP4 and head back in there and it is a QP4, there's the code. So we know the code has already been inserted into our page so that that portion of it is working correctly. Now you head back to your business manager settings and you come and select verify domain. And you can see that affiliate success lab domain has now been verified, select done. That status of that has changed to verified in this middle tab, as well as at the top here, it's turned to a green verified. And that is how easy it is. 
If you're using any other hosting provider like WordPress or Wix or any one of those, the piece of code that you're going to enter into your website is always going to go into the header section of your page or into your actual website. So just check the documentation of those particular hosting sites and they will tell you exactly how to access the header section of your website. And once again, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that all important notification bell. So to the next video, have a great day. Ciao.